How's it going everyone? This is Movie and Game Lover 98, and today I'll be doing a movie review on this classic movie from 1965, and that is The Sound of Music. So yeah, let's get started, and I hope you guys enjoy it, and hopefully like it. But to any guys out there who don't like this movie, I respect your opinion. So yep, here's what my copy looks like. The history on The Sound of Music, it first released on March 2nd, 1965, and then it was released onto home media multiple times, just years after it came out, but it wouldn't get a DVD release until the end of August 2000, basically for the film's 35th anniversary, yeah. And then it got a behind-the-scenes-of-the-movie DVD release in November 2005. Well, yeah, 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 I'm pretty sure. You know, to commemorate the film's, um, oh, what was it? Oh, 40th anniversary. There we go. There we go. I almost forgot it. And then it was released onto Blu-ray for the first time for the film's 45th anniversary on All Souls Day 2010, just about two days after Halloween that year, which is the version I have. And then it was released onto Blu-ray once again. On March 10th, 2015, well, for the film's 50th anniversary, and yeah. So I think that was all the history, but if there was a version on home media I missed, comment me down below, because I'm pretty sure there was, it might have gotten a 4K release, I don't know. So yep, that was the history, now let's look at my copy, then we'll talk about the plot of the movie. Yep, here's what my copy looks like, it almost looks like the VHS release from 1996, but there are so many versions of the sound of music you can imagine. Yep, Blu-ray plus DVD, because this is the version from 2010. Rogers and Hammersteins, I think, or Hammersteins, The Sound of Music, and you have Maria in the with the hills in the background and some pasture flowers and some trees in the background. It says, an all-new experience in high definition plus new extras, interactive maps, sing-alongs, and more. Yep, 45th anniversary edition, because this is from 2010. But the film is from 1965, and yeah. Yep, here's the front. Here are the spines of the slipcover. Create a whole picture of Maria. Yep, here's the back. It says, The Hills Are Alive on Blu-ray. Yep, you got the seven children of the Captain Von Trapp. Yeah, the Captain's children, yeah. Yep, you got your bonus features on all discs. That's the fact that... Well, yeah, yeah, we all know the film's rated G, I think. Well, yeah, I'm pretty sure. Yep, here's the actual case. Looks the same as we all know with Blu-ray versions of movies. Ooh, interesting. I don't think this was ever in here. Well, well I'm pretty sure it was. We'll offer for movies, but this is so many decades old. Well, it's already 10 years old, this version. Yep, here's the Blu-ray disc with the movie, and you have Maria. And you, well, there's the Blu-ray disc with the bonus features, and you see the seven children, just like on the back cover. And there's the DVD disc, which again has Maria. So yep, let's get with the plot of The Sound of Music. It starts off with this young woman named Maria, well, played by Julie Andrews who wants to have some spirited time, and she she's really concerned. So this this church woman, well, the one, uh, Lady Abby's, played by, I think it's the late Peggy Wood. I think she may she rest in peace now to find a way to do this, and she uh, ends up having some fun with the captain's seven children. Yep, Captain Von Trapp's seven children, well, yeah, Captain Von Trapp, yes, played by the late Christopher Plummer, may he rest in peace. And they just have fun together, and yeah. So, really, yeah, that's the basic plot of this movie, so what do I think of The Sound of Music? Obviously a classic, it's just so great, and just everything's a great about this film. Yes, and yes, the screenplay is great, I'll just say screenplay because this is a live-action film. Yes, the screenplay is great, and yes, we all know that. And yep, the cast does an amazing job. I'll just say cast because this is a live-action film. 
Julie Andrews does an amazing job as the the woman Maria. Christopher Plummer, like I said, may he rest in peace, because I mentioned him in my up review, because I did it in honor of the late Ed Asner. He does an amazing job playing the captain of the seven children, or basically, I just say the father of the seven children, in this movie. I'm saying that. And, yeah, and I think the other actor, well, I'll just call him Mr. Bill, he does an amazing job the singing voice, well, the, the, the dubbing for his singing, and yeah. And you know, Peggy Wood does an amazing job as the church lady mother, Abby's, I think that's her name. I think it's Abby's, I don't know. And yeah, all the other cast does an amazing job, and yes, the musical numbers are great. Yep, I think some of the great songs like A Few of My Favorite Things, Do Re Mi, 16 Going on 17, and of course, the So Long Farewell song, and yeah. Yep, something like that. So yeah, and you know, yes, everything else is also great. Yep, I also like how the settings take place in a village, like, in a cool house, and, that, and yeah. So yeah, The Sound and Music is a great movie, and I definitely give my ranking definitely 5 out of 5 stars. It's just a classic, and everyone should absolutely try out the sound of music if they've not seen it. But I'm see a lot of people, well, I've seen a lot of people told me they have seen the sound of music and yeah. But to any of you guys out there who haven't seen the sound of music, I definitely give it a watch. Yeah, I definitely recommend give it a watch and tell me what you think about it. But if you guys out there are not a huge fan of this movie, I respect your opinion because you know I don't think most of you guys would probably like this movie because you know a lot of people don't like it when the people sing and yeah. But I don't mind this because you know it's a musical and... Yes, when I get Chi Chi Bang Bang, I will explain why I like that film just as good as this movie. So anyways, yep, that's going to be it for this movie review, everyone, on the classic movie from 1965, The Sound of Music. And yep, hopefully you guys like this movie review. And yeah, to any of you guys out there who have not seen it, definitely give it a watch. But I'm pretty sure 100% of you guys have absolutely seen this movie when it came out on video many years ago, and yeah. So, yep, that's going to be it for this movie review, everyone, on The Sound of Music. Hopefully you liked it, and stay tuned for other stuff coming soon to my YouTube channel. And hopefully, yep, it'll be really exciting to show. So, yep, stay tuned for that video coming up, everyone. And it's going to be really cool.